Hey y'all, I'm Lockleth and it is day four of Lockleth Cozy Week. I hope y'all have been well. Like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell if you've been enjoying this. And let me know as well what you've been doing during the holiday season. Are you seeing family? I would love to know. And speaking of family, I've got another family-friendly game for y'all today with Transformers Earth Spark expedition it's based off of the series apparently they made a game based off of it but you battle and explore as bumblebee in an adventure to stop his nemesis mandroid from becoming the ultimate evil cyborg now it has been a moment since i've watched transformers i watched them when it was shia labeouf labeef who was the main actor in that movie franchise and so I haven't watched any of the animated shows, but I'm excited to dip my little toe back into some Transformers today with something that was developed by Tessera Studios and again published by Outright Games. I am an Outright Games ambassador, so of course I had to showcase another gem of theirs that came out this year, came out on October 13th of 2023, available on Nintendo Switch. PlayStation 4 and 5, Xbox One, and Xbox Series X and S. So let's get into Transformers Earth Spark Expedition. That is a mouthful. And let's see what this game is all about with our pal Bumblebee. Robbie, Mo, I just got ambushed by a bunch of Arachnomechs. Androids Arachnomechs? Didn't we comprehensively kick his shiny metal plated backside, B? thought so. But maybe there's more to Mandroid than uh, meets the optics. Look, keep the Terrans from rolling out till I get there. Mind telling us how? Do what I do. Improvise. I think a spider bot sweep is in order. Thrash? Seconded. Not a moment to waste. Count us in, Twitch. Wait! I got a better idea. Have you? No. Give me a moment. Hmm. Two words. Roll, play. Mildly interested. Go on. For starters, let's review what we know about the Emberstone. Right. In case we miss something critical. When Robbie and I found the stone in that creepy cave, we had no idea what it was or what was about to happen. We are the most fearless adventurers that ever existed. And of course we had to touch it. And then boom! Its power made you guys appear out of nowhere. You were born on Earth, forged from Earth's own elements, and empowered by the Ember Stone. That's how we became a family. And bonded to us via these cool cyber sleeves. I always love this story. We know all this. What else? And what about Mandroid? He got kind of obsessed with us. Well, who wouldn't be? Well, he's a former ghost scientist who was badly injured in the war the Autobots fought against the Decepticons here on Earth. So now he carries a king-sized grudge against all things Cybertronian. Ooh, ooh, and he's been using mind control patches to make transformer spots do his bidding. Wait, wait, this is all past tense. We beat Mandroid. He's solid gone. If Arachnomechs are still in play, maybe Mandroid wasn't as totally trash as we thought. Yeah! We should review that final battle, blow by blow. We were pinned down, under fire. Mandroid was making good on this threat to eliminate all Cybertronian life forms on Earth. This Emberstone powered death tower was blitzing the area. It was like the power of the Ember Stone ran through us. Making us think and act like one being. Terrans, united! Until finally, his plans and his tower came crashing down around him. Any chance he could have returned? Nah, <laughs> we got him good. Oh no, improvise, improvise! What? 
Who's ready for a new challenge? From the animations to some 3D style, I love that they went over, especially for those that don't watch the show. Like, I feel like I've, I've caught up now, even though I haven't watched the series whatsoever. So I like how they did that at the beginning. It's very nice, especially for something that's meant for kids. And look at us. We are Bumblebee. He was my literal favorite from the movies. I just love him so much. Love him to death. Love the name. We're running around. We're stomping the yard. Hopefully not to step on anyone. That would be terrifying because we are way too big. A new day brings new challenges, Bumblebee. And there's nothing like greeting it with a good workout. Uh, not that I don't appreciate the effort, Alex, but I'm a highly trained Autobot trooper as it is. Humor me. It's rare I get to call the shots around here. Press Y to punch, press X to kick. And I'm going to turn this up just a bit with the game volume. Hopefully that's better, but let's see. Create combos by using punches and kicks. Try Y, Y, Y. Bye, 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 bye. <laughs> so this is a side quest. It looks like so many seconds. Oh, gosh. Giving us the edge. Okay. I did that. Got gold. Okay. Now, when I say jump, you say how high? B to jump, okay. <laughs> Easy peasy. targets all around the farmyard. Let's see if you can bag the lot. Uh, ZR to shoot, okay. That's one patrol that won't be reporting into their boss. I was easy. Okay, is that it? Oh, no, over here. And last but not least, speed track. Okay, finally, last one. The farm track in vehicle mode. Fast as you can. Go, go. R to convert into alt mode and vice versa. Okay. How do we go? Oh, we just go forward. It's a racing game, y'all. We're in a racing game now. <laughs> I feel like there's going to be a lot of, like, racing in this, too, which I am not mad about. I don't get to play as many racing games on my channel, because how cozy is racing? On a scale of 1 to 5, how cozy is racing games? And now, you're ready for anything. Just in time. That's an alpha alert. We got trouble. Bumblebee, Alex, good. We tracked those arachnomechs that attacked you back to a decommissioned ghost base. I need you to investigate. We're on it, Optimus. Should we wait for Robbie and Moe to get back? They went out on an earlier call with Dot and Megatron. Optimus Prime is huge. No, they're liable to be tied up for a while. This can't wait. If Mandroid is back, we need to know. Did Optimus seem a little abrupt to you? Uh, not his usual cheery self. Maybe he's just got a lot on his mind. Let's roll! This is it, Bumblebee. The former ghost-based Optimus Flagdown. Appears deserted. But if those Arachnomex did come from here... Someone's coming. Alex, get behind me! An owl. Uh, 
Only me. Optimus thought you might need backup after all. Hard to say, Nightshade, until we know what we're dealing with. Hey, 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 the gang's all here. The other Terrans are helping me get this place fit for purpose again. Hey, Twitch, where'd you want this? Looks like junk, hashtag. So, junk it. Don't look so worried, Bumblebee. We'll get the core systems back online. Uh, somehow. So you won't be flying blind. Good to hear, Thrash. I'm gonna need all the help I can get. What is it, Nightshade? You seem a little... perplexed. I am. We've managed to access all areas of the base... Except one. It seems to have its own security system and power. There's and always one. Shielded. The sensors can't get a read. Strange. I could reach out to Dot, see if she knows anything about it. No, don't bother her. I'll crack it eventually. It looks like a stored message. But who... What? Mandroid? But he's alive and Ew. Uh, it's good to be back. If you are hearing this, phase two of Operation Annihilate All Cybertronians has been initiated. Soon, my new robot army will rise, empowered by Cybertronian technology from the very depths of planet Earth. Now, nothing can stop me. Mandroid needs either some coffee or just a large nap. Look at those eyes. No, thank you. And a shower. And a shave. Oh, those veins. Oh, too much. Too much. But you are more than welcome to try. What did he mean? Depths of the earth. At a guess, I'd say some kind of mining operation. But why give us the location? It makes no sense. Evil, maybe? Question is, do we take the bait? <laughs> we don't, Alex. Once the Terrans have this place set up as a makeshift command post, I'll need you here to coordinate my efforts in the field. Hashtag, think you can get the ground bridge up and running for me? No problemo. Why do they have, like, we've got Twitch, we've got Hashtag, like, why do they have these names? It's, uh, I'm sorry, a little cringe. <laughs> Good, because I intend to take the fight to Mandroid. Finally, okay, we got through the lore. Let's get through some final gameplay. Beam me down, Scotty. Nice. Hey, we're cooking. Oh, the pop in. <laughs> oh, no. This is giving Legends of Zelda, not Legends of Zelda, this is giving Legends of Arceus, the Pokemon game. You know, the portal in the sky. Whoa! Mandroid means business. Better report in. Optimus, it's much, much worse than we thought. There's deep level mining going on here, and the whole canyon's swarming with Mandroid's minions. We're analyzing the data from your sensor sweep as we speak, Bumblebee. Don't yet know for sure what Mandroid's digging for, but I have my suspicions. I need you to shut this whole operation down, fast. Will do, but I'm just one bot up against who knows how many enemies. I'll need real-time tactical updates. And you'll have them. You're not alone, Bumblebee. I'll be with you every step of the way. Me too, B. Thanks to Nightshade, the ghost base is, well, Semi-operational again. 
And I even have space archaeological backup that'll allow me to see below ground as well as above. I can go now. Thank I you. I'm going in. What's my first move? Target the outer enemy encampments dotted around the perimeter, Bumblebee. Each one that you liberate weakens Mandroid's overall control of the region, allowing you access to his inner strongholds. And we found a health kit and boost kits. Apparently, we can find those. And you'll be able to harvest resources that will aid you in your quest. Then it's time to kick metal aft plate. Let's do this. We pick up nuts and bolts. Oh. I'm just gonna do a lot of exploring, finding boxes, destroying things, whatever I can do. I don't really need a health kit right now, but I'll grab it. Gotta get I think we can find gas too. Wasn't expecting that. A road diner way out in the middle of the middle of nowhere. Careful B. That bland exterior could mask any number of Android machinations. True enough, Alex. Take nothing at face value. Maybe I should go check out what the lunch special is today. There's no one here. <laughs> Lies. Nothing. Nothing up here. Defeat enemy camps and complete side missions to unlock this level's mandroid lair. Okay, let's do it. This'll be a simple piece of cake. Mercenary, please. I ain't scared. Now press A to dodge. Okay. Easy. Look how easy that was. So simple. Child's play. Oh, more? Oh, gunner. Okay. Well, that's fine. I can dodge your bullets, gunner. Once a camp is liberated, you can use it to fast travel. Okay, cool. Press minus to access the map. I love using the phrase done and dusted. So I'm happy to see that in this game as well. I think it's a possible British term. That's the only time I've ever heard it. I don't know. Have y'all heard of that phrase? Is it just me? Do you have do you use the phrase? Or is this the first time you've heard it? Done and dusted. Y'all need to use it more. Just like I use um will do or can do a lot more. Be prepared. Right. Oh, that's how you use the health. Okay, cool. I'm just gonna drive. Not for very long. <laughs> you do drive faster than you do, like, run around, though. Not sure where I'm going or if this is the correct way, but we 
you just gonna do it? Scrap is valuable. Collect scrap. Um, to buy new items. Okay, cool. We've been... <laughs> we've been doing that anyways, because I like to collect everything. Nice. So nuts and bolts are currency. Got it. Drive full throttle at ramps to jump over gaps. Neato. Yes, friend, what do you need? Oh yeah, Twitch. Nope, but I'm at your service anyway, Twitch. <laughs> What's that? Humor? I really need to develop a new subroutine for that. What do you need? Telemetry on androids made out of scrap bots. And for that, we need to put them through their paces. So, a race? I'm understood. Ah, an Earth-based linguistic semantic reference. Oh, clearly I need a subroutine for that, too. Whatever. Ready, set, go! A race? Is that what they said? We can do it. Let's go. It actually controls really well. I'm just using the left uh, joystick on the Joy-Con to turn and everything, and it's very smooth. Like, I don't feel like I'm gonna run off the track, which is nice. I'm not sure how many- oh, two laps, okay. Easy. That was impressive! You really are as good as you say you are. They say you Terrans have yet to master sarcasm. Well, we could repeat the race, or we can just not. So I'm gonna just carry on. I'm gonna keep on keeping on. And figure out how to... get further up. Well, I keep accidentally. <laughs> Kept accidentally going into my car form. I need to remember it is R2, not R. I also have this on the normal mode, not easy mode. So what you are seeing is basically how difficult it is. So it hasn't been too terrible so far. Y'all know I'm not great at games. But I did want to try it out on the regular normal mode, because this is supposed to be meant for families and for children, so wanted to give it a good the good college try, just for y'all, like I tend to do with the outright games. I psyched him out by going into <laughs> my car mode. Oh, is this, um... Is that gas? I guess? There's so much traversing in this game. I just guessed? Only be broken with a charge shot. I don't think I know how to charge a shot yet. And I just wasted my fuel. Okay, here we are. Here's the map. We've completed a few different things. Hmm. 
There's a card. That's that thing that you bust through, which I can't get to yet. Enemy mission. There's another base camp. I honestly don't know where to go from here. Oh, I'm gonna get all turned around. <laughs> and then I went up the- oh yeah, I def- I went in this way. I remember. I went in this way. This is taking us back through, but maybe I need to go this way. So let's try that instead, and I'll see y'all once I get over there. Okay, I think I'm in a new spot. I had to, like, backpedal quite a bit and go back to the area where I did the race. And I think, yes, here we go. Now we're gonna see some new things. Definitely follow the map. It is your best friend. A card. Oh, a card collecting. Neat. Now, how do I get up there is another story. So far, the enemies aren't giving me too much trouble, but we do need to get to that. Oh wait, how do we... Where was the... cord? I gotta figure out how to... get to the place that this cord... ends. Oh, go through. And of course... Brill. Another kit, but I'm already too full. I have too many. Because I'm just a beast at this game. I did it. I can go back. Shoot. And I'm not gonna worry about the other one. We're just gonna go. <laughs> We're just gonna go. Avoid conflict when possible, especially when you've beaten them before. Aha, uh -huh, card. Tis mine. One more card to my expanding collection. I feel so good at games playing this. <laughs> Especially up against all the bad guys. Like, I feel like I'm doing something here. Never felt so powerful. Oh, this is something, but what is it? Shoot all the tar targets in time. Oh boy. It is timed. Okay, we need to figure out where they all are first. Okay, there's one here. One, two. Is there only three? Bad guys down there. Oh, what is with the color here? What happened? And one here? Okay. No, oh, shoot. Why? All right, well. Oh, we have 20 seconds left. Oh. Oh, I see. Oh, that's plenty of time. Five, four, three. 
Barely. Barely. Just in time. <laughs> I did it, though. I did it. Oh, this is why the color messed up. We're about to go up against this dude? Is this a baddie? Looks like a giant octopus drill. It's not funky fresh, it's more so funky. Guess that was just the warm up. I've come to something at the dead end, Optimus. I'm locked out of the drill site's inner strongholds. You must find a way in, Bumblebee. And then disable Mandroid's Arachna drill. Arachna drill. Arachna drill? What's that? A mobile drilling platform. Very versatile. It allows Mandroid to excavate virtually any site in the canyon. At a so, the quicker I take him out, the less chance he has of reaching that buried cache of Cybertronian ordnance. You can do it, B. I believe in you. We believe in you. Aw, thanks. Great. Now all I gotta do is believe in myself. Here we go. Deactivate the huge arachna drill in the epic camp. Oh, epic. To do this, you must first defeat all the defenses. Okay. Defeat all enemies. Okay. The defender that protects the camp will fight you. Okay. Then the energy generators will now be vulnerable. Okay, destroy them and stop. Let's do the dang thing. I'm ready. Marauder? 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 <laughs> ah, a marauder? Defeat the marauders. Okay, defeated all them. I like that they give you a lot of places to heal. A lot of the a lot of the health kits. For children playing the game who might struggle a little bit more than me, hashtag pro gamer. Um, that's nice to see. Oh, come on. Bumblebee Ninja Bot. Time to get down and dirty. When it comes to the crunch, Alex, I'm your bot. Boom. Oh, here we go. Oh, he's got a crown over his head. Ooh. Scary. I'm so scared. Ooh. All right, let's uh, heal. Move, move, move. Move, 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 move! Why am I not moving? <laughs> oh boy. No, move! 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 There we go. Easy. Easy. Move. Move. <laughs> Go towards. Hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. He's stunned. Move. Move, move, move. <laughs> the amount of times I'm like just skipping around. And hoping for the best! Oh my god. <laughs> move, move, move. Hit, 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 hit. You got him, you got him. Boom. Low flying aircraft, beware. Okay. 
Now I've got to find all of the things to destroy. Listen up, Mandroid. You've done your worst, and I'm still standing. I'm coming for you next. Not so fast, B. Mandroid's inner perimeter defenses may be a lot tougher to navigate than we first thought. You need a timeout. I do? I thought time was of the essence. It is, but I've thrown together some training sequences specifically designed to help you overcome whatever's in the offing. So come on back to Ghost Base. It'll be time well spent. Trust me. I do, Alex. Completely. Looks like I'm going back to warrior school. Okay, y'all. I am going to end the video right here. That was Transformers Earth Spark Expedition. I hope you enjoyed another little outright games staple or a game that came out this year. Let me know in the comments below if you are purchasing any outright games, if you've purchased any in the past, what are some that they've released or are releasing in the future that you want me to play here on my channel? But thank y'all for enjoying another day with me during Lockleth Cozy Week, and I'll see y'all again tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching.